next man. I tend to break things. I always thought I was incapable of holding anything the right way until I realized that some things just don't want to be held. I offer embrace. She she only wants arms length and the passion and, 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 and the struggle. I tend to break things. My understanding of love is bald tires, black ice crash inevitable, but I still strap in. Enjoy this ride or die trying. I'm racing towards dead end devotion until I reach the reoccurring collision of reality because the outcome of redlining love is always an accident. Just waiting to happen, but to have it. I tend to break things. And so I total my heart into car wrecked women. Fresh lemons, they look beautiful, glistening, outsides, insides, twisted, distorted, broken. They will drive off with you assuredly, but then die on you soon. They move like the only properly functioning parts of them are their rear view mirrors. They always so stuck in the past. They claim they can fix things. They all try to fix things, but they are very handy with emotional wrenches. End up screwing me over. I meant over screwing me. I never used to hold me this tight, but see so many bad bricks make it hard to stop swerving into oncoming emotion. So baby, lie to me again. Tell me, tell me that you know what you're doing with that smile glowing like a check engine light. Now please, because I need to, I need to appreciate this beautiful bleeding heartbreak embrace. I need to love the fact that there is finally no struggle there, baby. Try your best, but understand, just like I had to continuously crash into the understanding that broke things can't fix. Broke things. I know how this ends. Crash is inevitable. My kind of love has always been an accident just waiting to happen, but to have it. I tend to break things. Especially myself. Our next act. Everybody, is that cool? Say word. Word. All right, all right. Um, our next act is the muse. The muse.